three rounds, five minutes, okay? Light butt in, no glue attack, okay? No spine, okay? And two stamp, okay? Okay. And still, here we go. go. 100 records, but... As I said earlier... From Diaz, and down, that was a good... Day. The Muay Thai exponent. Smart move, because that's exposing that arm to attacks. He's yelling for that key lock, telling him to attack. This is going to be a dangerous position if Sadilayev doesn't get out. Oh, very nice. Your cardio and also your muscle fatigue. Oh. Leads with his right hand to Diaz. Needs to step outside of that front foot and start circling away. Square on with his body. There it is again. It comes back with all oh, brutal kick. I mentioned in the first round. This is the leg trip we haven't seen more of that. Considering, you know, Ryan Diaz has been setting the pace of the fight, setting up a lot of throws, a lot of punches, a lot of kicks, it's going to be really difficult. Diaz on his back. Step by step instructions from the corner men. Better be careful here, or else yeah. Sadilaf's going to yeah. take his back. There it is. Now. Here it is. Now we've got to see if Brian Diaz can defend the choke. He's got the right hand tied. As he twists round. Yeah, well done. Great strength from Diaz there to swing that one around. Just as the arm was going around the throat as well. Sadilaf's going to have some position options here. He's going to see if he can either posture up and throw some punches down or Ryan Diaz is giving him those arms. He may just create some space and try to finish it right away with an arm bar. But that X factor, like we always talk about, that sweat and the natural oil your body produces, you got to really think about, do I want to give up my position and try for a higher risk maneuver like throwing up that arm bar or not? Oh, oh, looking nice. for a darts choke here. He's got that left arm in deep. Ah, I can't really tell from this angle how tight it is, but that left arm's in. Oh, there it is! Yes! Oh, Jason, you saw it. And you